Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing okay and that you've all had a good week. <laughs> Today's the day we're going to Egypt. I can't stop smiling. I'm very excited. <laughs> my sister is here. She has um, been telling me all the sisterly stuff before we leave. <laughs> but yeah, we are ready to go. We're packed. The Uber is on its way. The pre-booked Uber. Yay. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, not much else to say. Let's let's get into this holiday. I'm very very excited. You excited? Yeah. Very talkative this one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go. I'll see you later. Bye. Have fun. Bring me back a present. Oh my god, you and everybody else. <laughs> Can't beat a bit of duty free, can ya? <laughs> <laughs> we got our gate number. Let's go. Exciting. We're in Egypt. It's half past 11 at night, but we're in Egypt. <laughs> now to collect the bags. Bathroom. <gasps> Got bath and everything. Is this a window into the shop? lighting and everything. Our bags have just been delivered to us. We didn't even have to walk them to the room. That's awesome. Cupboards. Large bed. Yeah, you can fully see. Oh my God, I'm so gonna have that closed. <laughs> Out into our own little private. Extra bed. That's where you go when you're in trouble out into our own little private pool. How do I open this thing? <gasps> oh my God, with our own little sunbeds. <gasps> it's all out here. What we're thinking. What's that? Don't jump. Mate, this is so cool. <laughs> well, that's the room. This is our room for a week. It's 
got your name on the telly. Sort of, half of it. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> okay, so as you would have seen, we are in the room. It's very nice. Oh, very excited to stay here for the week. So we are very tired from the journey and the long flight. So we're just gonna head to bed and we will see you in the morning. I was gonna say good morning, but it's not the morning. <laughs> good afternoon, guys. That was like a very much needed lay-in that we had, like the longest sleep ever. It's currently nearly one o'clock. We've been awake for what, half an hour? Yeah. Ish. Currently, we are about to go for a little walk around the hotel to see where everything is from where our room is. And then we're gonna go get some lunch and then we'll probably just come back to our room and chill out by our private pool that's out there. So yeah, very exciting. I will see if I can film anything on our little walk so we can see where everything is. But yeah, that is what we're gonna be doing today. So see you in a sec. No sharks in there. <laughs> Callum said it should be netted up, so I should be good. <laughs> yeah? I think so. There's people up. People right on the end of the pier, right there. It's so pretty. And it's honestly so hot. My hair has gone so flat already, that's how humid it is. Because it's going back to its natural dead straightness and I'm sweating already like it's so hot how are you feeling yeah hot. you're hot yeah. oh, Jesus Christ well beach waves are a fail <laughs> <laughs> we found the place in the hotel with all the shops in it it's a boat on the water so okay, we're back at the room. My hair is as flat as anything. That didn't last very long, did it? No. And for the rest of the day, this is where we are going to be. Relaxing, reading, finishing some TikToks. So by the time this video is posted, those TikToks will be posted on my TikTok. So go check them out because they're going to be good, aren't they? Yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah, just going to chill. It is, honestly, so hot. What is the, what is it? 32? 33. 33 degrees Celsius. And yeah, we are, <laughs> we're slightly dying, but it's so nice. We're going to get in the pool, cool down, chill. Yeah, so. We'll see you. Maybe I'll do a little video when we're when we're relaxed and chilling and stuff. So I feel like a mermaid. <laughs> Right, so it's evening time now, as you can probably tell, and we are getting ready to go out. Well, Callum is ready. I'm just going to do a tiny little bit of makeup and then I'm going to straighten my hair. So it shouldn't take me too long, but we had a great day relaxing and having a look around the hotel, we 
literally, as you saw, we just relaxed by the pool that is in our room, which is honestly so convenient. I don't know if you would have seen, but in the last video, I had a drink and basically one of the guys that works in the hotel, one of the staff, he literally came up to the other side of the pool that's connected to our room and asked if we wanted any drinks. So I was like, yeah, I'll have a vodka and Coke, thanks. So yeah, he walked away, got us some drinks and came back again. And that was that, we just chilled by, by the pool. So it was very nice, wasn't it? Mm, yeah. But yeah, so we're just getting ready to go out to, well, I say go out, go to the main restaurant where we'll be having dinner and stuff. Although I'm slightly scared that they're not gonna let me in with this dress on because basically during the day, if you have lunch in the main restaurant and you're in your swimwear, they basically ask you to go and put some clothes on and then come back again before you can go into the restaurant. And this dress is slightly revealing. So I don't know how well this is gonna go, but I've got my little kimono thing. So I can always just put that on to eat dinner and then we'll probably go and sit somewhere maybe by the bar or something and have some drinks before we come back to the room so yeah i'm literally just going to finish my makeup and then that is us ready for the evening and then i will show you my full outfit okay so this is the full look for the outfit tonight got gold jewelry on which is very rare for me but if the outfit deserves gold jewelry it it deserves gold jewelry so yeah, got some gold jewelry on. This jewelry is literally from that Amazon set that I did for the 1970s party. So it's quite cute. And then these are Sheen, I think, or Primark. I don't know, either one. But yeah, this is a full outfit. Babe, show them your outfit. Callum's outfit, lovely. And yeah, we are ready to go for dinner. Once I get my kimono out. So we're back in the room. We're just gonna chill in the room for the rest of the night, aren't we? Because although we've chilled all day, I'm still a bit tired from traveling yesterday, not gonna lie. We had a nice dinner, went to the bar, had some drinks, and then went for a wander. And yeah, now we're back in the room and we're gonna get ready for bed. <laughs> not gonna lie, I've already taken all my jewelry off because I did that as soon as we got in. <laughs> but yeah, so, we're just going to chill and I will catch up with you guys in the morning. Good morning, guys. And I can actually say that this time because we've woken up within a decent time. So it is the morning. We have walked out to our little private pool area to the most beautiful sunshine ever. It is so hot already, but this morning Callum and I are going to go to the reception to go and look at prices of taxis and stuff because tonight we're looking and hoping to go to the Farsha Cafe which is really exciting. I can't wait to go to that. It's basically Aladdin in one little cafe. So yeah, that should hopefully be good. So that's what we're gonna do this morning. And then throughout the day, we're literally just gonna chill until we go to the cafe. So yeah, we'll see what the day brings us with our chilling, hey. Mm. We're probably literally just gonna stay here. We might not go to the beach until like the end of the week. So yeah, uh, see you if anything happens.
So after being in the pool for about an hour and a half, we're going to get some food in my kimono and my trousers. And then we're gonna go and see prices of taxis for Farsha Cat. Right, that's it. Taxi is booked for 5.45 for us to go to Farsha tonight. So that's exciting. So literally gonna chill for the rest of the day until about half four and then I will start getting ready for us to go out. So yay, exciting. You don't seem too happy. Bye. <laughs> don't bother you. Because there's something to do, doesn't it, later? go get the taxi to go to Farsha Cat, which is really exciting. We've showered, we're changed. I've done my hair. I've done this little fishtail, which considering I haven't done a fishtail plait in a very, very long time, it's actually turned all right, turned out all right, and I'm quite impressed with myself. So, yeah, and then I'm just gonna do some makeup. I need to put this moisturizer all over my face because I have gone a little bit red. <laughs> oh, thanks. But yeah, so I'm just gonna do my makeup and then we're ready to go. Honestly, I cannot wait. I'm so excited. Seeing all the videos of Farsha online, I'm just, I'm so excited to go. It's literally gonna be like Aladdin. And um, <laughs> I can't even like not say I'm excited because I'm just gonna keep saying I'm so excited. But yeah, I'll try and get as many videos when we're there as possible. And hopefully I can catch all the lights turning on because that'll be really cute. So basically it's just gone five now and we're getting the taxi at 5.45 and sunset is at 6.45 and it takes half an hour to get there. So we should get there by about quarter past six so that we can see the sunset and hopefully see all the lights turn on. You excited to go? Yeah. Yeah, you're so excited to see a bunch of lights turn on. <laughs> but yeah, so we'll hopefully show you what it's like at Farsha and get some videos. I think it's just a cafe, isn't it, really? Yeah. So we can get some food and get some drinks and just be around a lot of people. It's probably going to be so crowded but it's gonna be worth it so yeah just finishing this little bit of makeup and then we're going to be on our way to Fasha
currently nine o'clock. We've just got back. Um, we got back to the hotel at like half past eight, but we went and had some dinner in our main restaurant of the hotel before we come back here. So, yeah. So we've had dinner after Farsha. When at Farsha, we had snacks. We had a snack. We had a fruit platter, which was like, it was all right. Okay, it wasn't yeah. too bad. I suppose it was a bit warm because of how humid it was. But yeah, we had a fruit platter and I had a cocktail and you had a beer, mm. didn't you? Mm. But overall, I thought it was amazing. We couldn't see the sun setting from where we were sitting. It kind of went back behind where we were but when the lights came on it was honestly so magical and then they started playing the arabian Nights song from aladdin which i thought was brilliant like it just kind of like made the experience because it's like you were sitting in aladdin and then they played arabian nights it was it was so good well that's what i thought anyway <laughs> no, it was nice. It was nice. It was all sitting on the floor, or basically on the floor. Pretty tight. An hour, a little bit anyway. Yeah, it was nice. Yeah, there was like loads of us in one area, so we all had to kind of like squidge next to each other. And yeah, we were sitting on like cushiony, small benches in that one area, weren't we? Yeah. So yeah, it was all kind of tight and compact. They were trying to fit as many people in as they possibly could. But yeah, overall the experience was... It's one that you can say that you've done it and it was awesome and it was great and it was so beautiful. But if you've done it once, you probably don't need to do it again. No. Really. I mean, I'd happily come back here, but come, like, go back to Farsha Lounge with like other people like friends or family or something but just us two like we've done it yeah yeah yeah. so but yeah it was it was really good and when we were walking up the stairs to leave it was really pretty wasn't it because all the lights were on so yeah it was really good very happy but that is us done for the evening i'm gonna chill and head to bed soon because i'm starting to get a bit tired now the sleep is catching up on me. I didn't sleep very well last night, so I'm getting tired now. But yeah, so we will see you guys in the morning. Good morning. Actually, it's the afternoon now. Yeah, I think it's just gone 12. So good afternoon, guys. Today is going to be another chill day. I have been sitting out by the pool this morning for a little bit, but honestly, I'm not going to sit out in the sun much today. I will go out and get in the pool when Callum gets in there for a little bit, but I'm not going to sit out in the sun all day today. I can feel myself getting a little bit of heat rash on my shoulders. They're starting to feel a bit bumpy. So yeah, I am going to stay in the shade most of today. I'll get in, I'll be in the sun every now and then. I got to catch those rays I need to get a little bit of a tan on my legs basically because my legs take ages to tan so like I'll probably either sit with my upper body in the shade and then my lower body in the sun or I'm just going to be in the shade I might come indoors sometimes as well because it's really nice and cool in here with the aircon on but yeah so not much sitting out in the sun for me today I don't want to make that heat rash any worse than it's already going to be definitely going to have to moisturise a lot today as well so yeah might not see you throughout the day today because it's definitely just going to be a chill day we're not doing anything we're going to go get some food soon because we're hungry but yeah chill day so i might just see you guys later tonight when we get ready to go for dinner so i'll see you then so it's the evening now and i'm nearly ready to go out to have dinner so Callum and I are having an early night tonight to prepare ourselves for tomorrow but 
I'm not gonna talk in detail about that now. I will talk to you about that later. So yeah, we're having an early dinner, but we've had a nice relaxing day. Literally just chilled, been in the pool. I literally started a book this morning, like a brand new book, and I'm already halfway through it. We literally have done nothing but just sit by the pool all day. You had a nice chill day, babe? Yeah. Yeah, that's relaxing. I definitely put a bit too much blush on there. Oh well. It'll match the rest of my body, it's fine. <laughs> Bloody hell. So once I'm finished with my makeup, I will show you my full outfit and then we will be ready to go for dinner. And here is my outfit for dinner tonight. Literally just put my hair in half up, half down with this hairband that's got a ribbon on the end of it. Thought that was cute. Put my go uh, gold, silver hoops in. I haven't got a necklace on today, but I thought the outfit was cute without it. And then just my dress, pretty. And we're ready to go. You ready? Beautiful. Right, let's go for dinner. We are back in the room. That was a quick dinner. It was actually kind of nice for it, to be honest, because usually I'll go around and pick loads of little bits up of different things. But tonight I literally just had chicken and mushroom pie and chips. It's so English, isn't it? <laughs> it's actually such an English meal. But it was quite nice. Pastry was a bit weird. It wasn't like puff pastry or anything. It was kind of sweet. Strange, but nice at the same time. Yeah. Anyway, so we had a quick dinner and now we're back in the room. What is the time? It's only half past seven, but tonight we need an early night. Because tomorrow, <laughs> we're getting up so early in the morning because tomorrow is our day trip to Cairo to go to the Pyramids of Giza, which is really exciting. But tonight was also the end of part one of this trip to Egypt because we've got so much more to film, especially in Cairo tomorrow so it's going to be a really long video so i'm splitting this egypt video into two parts so tonight was the end or today was the end of part one of our egypt trip but yeah so i hope you all liked part one of this trip please like and subscribe and i will see you in the next video to start off part two of our trip with our day trip to Cairo. So excited. Is it <laughs> so excited. Right, yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Bye guys. <laughs>